hey you guys what's up welcome back to my channel so for today's video you guys we're gonna get into and be playing with products that i've already showcased on my channel because i need to continue using them throughout the month but the main reason for this video is two of bh cosmetics newest launches the avocado toast palette and the bellini palette so if you're curious to see how these products perform and the look that i come up with then just keep watching Right, you guys first thing is first I'm also going to be incorporating my favorites as of right now before I test the Bellini palette it is the glowing and grease palette from BH I have raved about this on my channel so we're also going to play with that as well today starting off we're going to go in with the avocado toast palette but before I do that really quickly I am going to jump off camera <laughs> I'm going to prime my eyes as well as do my brows and I'm still using the XX Revolution brow pencil and yeah so I will be right back and we will get into a look all right, you guys, so going in with the BH Cosmetics Avocado Toast Palette before we get into it, just want to let you guys know this is a 16 shade palette, and as of the time I'm filming this video, it's on sale, so I'm not going to throw a price tag out there. I can tell you it is under, well under $20, and it's super affordable on their website. If you guys have never tried out any of their eyeshadows, they're very nicely pigmented, creamy, very easy to work with. What I love about this palette is that the color story is just, I mean, if you guys can see that, I know that the packaging is kind of bouncing off of the lights there. It's just beautiful. So we're just going to go ahead and jump right into it. I will insert some swatches when we get to talking about the products at the end of the video. So I have already set my eye primer with... Um, some translucent powder. I use the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder as well as my Ride or Die OG by Revolution. This is the Eye Elements in Central. This one is almost out. I am so excited to finish this up and open a fresh one. Does anybody else get like satisfied from finishing product? I definitely do. So I'm going to start off with this shade called Over Easy right here. And I'm going to follow that with Avo Toast, which is the shade right here. Just like the street lights lit this time, like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down. Can't be afraid to live this out. We got this far, don't know how. Here are the swatches. I really don't think I need to say much. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Beautiful. I'm very happy to have this in my collection. 
let's go ahead and get on with it. I can't wait to show you guys the look I created. Now keep in mind, I am not a makeup artist. I'm just obsessed with makeup. All right, you guys, so, so far here is the look that I've created with the palette. Of course, I'll zoom you in and show you a little bit later. We're gonna go ahead and get on with my face. Now, because I've used all of these products on camera before besides the lip, which is not from BH, and the Bellini palette, I'm gonna go ahead and have this sped up, and then when I get done with the face, get ready to finish the under eyes and use the Bellini palette as well as the lip product, then I will come back on and chitty chatty bang bang. <laughs> Alright you guys, so unfortunately <clears throat> my battery decided to start dying today so now I have to kind of speed things up. I have finished with the face. Um, I will leave everything linked down below if I run out of juice and I can't tell you guys everything that is on my face. But now, you know what, I totally forgot I wanted to play with this palette because I was freaking out about the battery. We're going to go ahead and get into it. So this is the BH Cosmetics Bellini palette. There are six gorgeous gorgeous peach shades in here you have mattes you have shimmers it's beautiful like this is every peach lovers heaven I won't say dream it's their heaven so I'm gonna go ahead and apply just peachy which is this shade right here a I think this is a clean brush yes if you guys have never tried their blushes I'm telling you they're the bomb Super pigmented, by the way. <laughs> and I knew that going in, so I don't know what I was thinking. So wait, I'm gonna take a bigger fluffy brush and kind of blend this out. I knew better, y'all. <laughs> oh, I cannot wait to play with this again some more, you guys. I can tell you guys right now, at the time that I'm filming this video, the are having they are having a nice sale on these so these palettes are on sale even though they're brand new moving on to the eye look i did use seven shades of the avocado toast palette in this look and i i know it's not everyday friendly but it to me is so fun and so pretty i'm gonna zoom you guys in so you can see everything Every shade that is on my eyes is from that palette. Now, for the eyeliner, I actually went in with this gorgeous eyeliner from Clean Color. You guys have not seen that haul yet, but it will be coming up. It's just this beautiful eyeliner here, and it's called Love Me 365 Smoky Eyeliner, and it is 106 Smoky Green. It does come with a smudge brush. But because I went down on the lower lash line with the exact same shades that I used in my crease and my outer V here, I did not need to smoke out the eyeliner. I think it is really fun. This is a really fun green look. I love green eyeshadow. So if you guys are wanting to check out another look that I did on my channel with green eyeshadow, that is actually my favorite until this. I'm going to link it up here for you guys. Um, I did not use this BH Cosmetics Glowing and Grease palette, again, just because I ran out of time. The majority of the products that are on my face, aside from the two new products that this video is actually about, they're all from XX Revolution. So if you were one of the ones that did not get to check that video because of, well, notifications are not going out again, you guys, and I do apologize for that. I'm going to link the video here as well as in the um, side cards that should be coming up on both sides of me. I do want to mention to you guys that I really had a lot of fun playing with this palette. Now, from the time I started using BH Cosmetics, which was years ago, I mean like more than 10 years, they have really stepped up their eyeshadow formula. Um, I remember when I did my, is it Beautiful in Barcelona palette review, I really wasn't impressed. And I don't know if maybe it was just me, the brushes I was using, the eye primer that I used. I'll link the video up here. Um, but 
I actually started to get rid of that palette and I put it back to my collection and I've used it since then and it's beautiful. All right, you guys, so camera died. I know I need another battery. Huh. So help your girl out by sharing my video if you wanna share it on your Facebook, your Instagram. Tell all your girlfriends, come hang out, come and join the fun, whatever, whatever. It's not the amount of subscribers you have, it's the amount of views you get. So anyways, you guys, I wanna talk to you really quickly about these two palettes. And um, that's pretty much the reason we're here. Anything else that I used on my face will be linked down in the description box below for you. Also, if you want to see the XX Revolution products that I used on my face for this look today, which probably looks 10 times crazy now because I look like I've been running a marathon. Well, I haven't. I've been doing a ton of stuff around the house and the farm and whatnot, so I've been sweating profusely. This is not a look that I would wear if I was going to be sweating. Back on track, Tosh. Okay, starting out with the avocado palette. I'm really happy that I picked this up. I love the color vibe in here. It is really like cool and really green and with some other pops of colors, two beautiful browns blends beautifully nicely pigmented the only shade that i thought in my opinion needed to be wet a tiny tiny bit was the one that i went on the inner lid with and that one was lemon pepper and really if you build it up and take your time you don't need to wet it but i was just trying to be a little extra so um i really felt like these were really easy to work with and as much as i've been sweating i am so surprised that these are still on my eyes as good as they are because I mean literally you guys my face has been drenched in sweat and the only thing that I did before I got on camera was put a little bit of concealer under my eyes because I'm dramatic when I'm hot <laughs> so yeah but yeah this is a really really beautiful palette if you like that kind of a color story now this does have 16 shades I was able to work with seven of those shades on my eyes today so I feel like I got a good idea of what the formula is like what to expect I know I have a great idea of what to expect as far as longevity. I've had these on for several hours and again you guys my face has literally been pouring with sweat and they look bomb. So if you're looking for something fun and fresh as they call it um, with a really pretty cool toned color story I say pick it up. It's really 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 pretty. Moving on to the next palette. I am so sorry, you guys. I almost forgot to use this, but y'all know your girl loves peach, so this will be incorporated in a ton, and I do mean a ton of upcoming videos. So if you are someone who likes peach shades, this is for you. Like, this is going to be your palette. I mean, this covers everything from super, super light peach to super deep peach and y'all best believe I'm gonna use every one of these shades this is gorgeous I have been waiting for a company to come out with an all peach shade palette like this these pans are huge you guys and if you're somebody who collects makeup like I do girl you gonna have this for a while I mean probably past the expiration date a while because the pans are just so large now you guys already know and you saw it on camera these are super pigmented so be very careful with these with these powders when you're going in on your face you want to dip very 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 little and tap the excess off and then go in also you guys did get to see I believe before the camera died that these blend out really really nicely so easy to work with a great price you're getting a ton of product. You do get a mirror in here as well. And can we talk about this packaging for just a second? How gorgeous is that? <laughs> so you guys already know what I think. I want to know what you guys think of what you got to see um, when I was applying these products. Are you going to be picking up this collection? Are you not going to be picking up this collection? Is it not your vibe? Is it your vibe? Now I know I am missing two products from this collection. Actually, I think I'm missing glosses too. But there was one product that I think... I wish I would have picked up, but I know I don't need it. I think it was called the Waffles, Belgian Waffles Palette. It's got bronzers and highlighters in it. You guys know I have a lot of those products, so I just kind of felt like I didn't need to buy another bronzer or buy another highlighter. I'm really, really trying to get through some of the products that I have, so it is an adorable palette. You get three bronzers, three highlighters, and 
you guys already know I love their formula so if I, if you're asking if I recommend it absolutely it's a great price tons of product and the formula is amazing I want to say thank you to you guys as always for taking time out of your busy days to come hang out with me you guys know I love you to the moon and back if you are new here what is up my name is Tash I hope you'll hit that subscribe button before you leave today as well as the bell notification so you are notified each time I upload and I want to say, if you have not checked out the Norvina Volume 4 video, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, when I make an announcement in July, you are going to be very upset with yourself. <laughs> you guys want to make sure you are watching that whole video so that you can find the surprise that I hid in the video. I will see you guys in the next one. You guys, please be safe out there. I love you. Bye.